following demonstration will apply a pressure as a function of the Z location on the part. We'll do that using a formula field. Since we want the Z location, we'll use Cartesian as the independent domain. And then we can create our formula. And we'd like it to be Z plus 1. So we'll use the Z from the filter. And if we type that in, we'll see that we get a dimension mismatch in that it's expecting pounds per square inch, which is also the fatigue strength coefficient units, which is what it's complaining about in the alert. So if we multiply that by one pound per cubic inch, then we'll get pounds per square inch, which is the units for pressure, which is what it's looking for. All right, and the one that we're adding to it, it also assumes is in PSI. So we don't have to uh, set the units for that. Then we can check the visualization of the field and also of the pressure load. And that concludes the demonstration.